Andrew Barry, at his end of the year press conference, said that um, they could create um, any cap space that they needed to do what they needed to do in free agency. Do you think they're fairly active in free agency this year? I do think they will be. And I think, um, yeah, I think sometimes these salary caps are just. It's just a thing that the league puts out there because everybody's able to work around them, Dave. There's, <laughs> there's no, you know, there's no hard, fast rules. It seems like it feels like no matter whose contract it is, you're going to kind of you can restructure it or renegotiate it or move. They're just moving piles of money around, right, to to fit their own needs. So, um, and I do think they'll be active. I think they'll be as, you know, they they took a big swing last year and um and and tried to land a couple of defensive players and maybe came up a little bit short, but then ended up with a guy like, you know, Dalvin Tomlinson. And um, I do think they're going to take a big swing this year in free agency, depending, again, what the market looks like, you know, for a wide receiver. But there are also some other needs. And, uh, you know, none of us knows exactly what their plans are with guys like, you know, Jed Wills. Um, we don't know about the health of Jack Conklin going forward. Um, you know, we don't know what they're going to do with Greg Newsom going forward. So what we look at today as potentially – uh, you know, possible areas of weakness or or areas that they want to strengthen over the next couple of years could be entirely different a, a week from now or or a month from now as we get closer to free agency. But I do think that this team knows that they are close, that they know that, you know, f- filling in a couple of spots, much like they did last year in free agency, will get them closer to that ultimate goal of winning a Super Bowl.